Hi everyone, this is Lisa again from Happy Go Hook Creations. This is gonna be part two of my Timu haul um, slash unboxing and review. This box is a lot bigger than the one I got last time. Okay, so it's this size right here. Um, before I get started, cause we're gonna dive right in, um, I believe there's probably 30 items in this box and I wanna get started so that this video is not that long. So I will have prices on everything. It'll like once I open it up and kind of show you. So once I edit this video, you'll see the prices and everything will be listed in the description box below. And remember, there'll also be a 30% off deal, but you have to be a new user in order to take advantage of that 30% off. We're gonna get right, yeah, we're definitely gonna get right in because, oh my gosh. They packed this box, you guys. They really packed it. Um, so if you are not, if you're watching for the first time and you're like, who the heck is that woman? You know, who is she? <laughs> I have, I this is my channel that normally deals with crocheting, uh, crochet patterns, makes, giveaways, all, you know, anything like crochet, yarn related. So when Timu reached out to me, and asked me to do a review or an unboxing, I saw the items that were listed. And I, as um, a small business owner as well, because I've got an Etsy shop, I do shows throughout the year um, as well. So I wanted this to actually benefit me for, you know, with what I do. So I ordered, a, you know, several items that, that, like I said, they give you a list and I put it in the description box if it popped up then that was something that I wanted to um, check out, review, to see if it's you know really gonna be worth it if, for me, because if it is, this is where I'll obviously purchase it because the prices, you really cannot beat the prices of this place. Um, I know a lot of people are skeptical about it. My, um, my granddaughter and my daughter, <laughs> they're, only, they're only a year apart. <laughs> so they're both teenagers, but I feel like, I get a box every week on my doorstep from Timu. It's a big, you know, an orange package, an orange box. Um, so I'm really glad that Timu reached out because I really wanted to know exactly what it was about. Make sure my kids um, aren't wasting their money. I mean, you know, if you're a mom or, you know, anybody who likes their money, which is pretty much everyone, right? You want to know that you're spending it well. So let's take a look at what's in this box and uh, hopefully I'll like everything. They want me to be honest and I'm gonna be honest. All right, so let's just grab a box. So first of all, these boxes are pretty, or these bags. I said let's grab a box, but let's, let's grab this bag. These are really nice bags. They're not like, I don't know, they, they just feel really nice. You might be able to hold on to these and, um, my daughter likes to package uh, her kids, their outfits, my grandkids. She puts them in individual baggies so that they can kind of pick what they want to wear for that day. Everything's matching right down to the socks. So just saying, it's a great idea. So I'm going to stack these up right here and as I go. So again, I am a crocheter. I have been one for over 40 years. So this, I was really looking forward to this one. We're just going to grab a bag. Forgive the rustling. Um, paper, well, I don't know, we'll just stack it over here. Okay, so it's a case, all right? When you open up the case, you have a set of crochet hooks. Metal. Um, yeah, from the smallest, these are really tiny. I don't use this, this size hook anymore. Um, and my handles have to be, I've had carpal tunnel surgery, so my handles have to be ergonomic. But um, this one isn't, you know, these three probably wouldn't be too terribly bad. But this is a nice set. Um, and again, I'm gonna have, like, so I'll have this open. The prices will be at the bottom once um, I get this edited so you'll know exactly how much I paid for this or how much it costs. <laughs> All right, so that's the first one. I'm really happy with that. The case is, you know, nice and sturdy, which is good. Oh man, guys, I hope I have enough room on this uh, table. All right, another, well, that's a pretty big bag for such a little thing, but let's see what's in here. 
Um, it takes, you know, it takes a couple of weeks um, for me to get it because, you know, the, the process going back and forth as a reviewer. But um, when my daughter or my granddaughter orders something, they can get, they usually get it within, you know, five to 10 days, maybe less. Okay, so this, oh, it's a lanyard. Okay, let me see if I can let me get this in. Wait, if I close it, will I be able to, I should be able to open it. So it snaps in place. Okay, so I ordered this because I wear these every day to work with my identification in here. Um, so that, that is a really nice, sturdy lanyard. And I like that it's got the little ribbon there. I have one now and it's um, it's leather. So when it's hot out and you don't have a collar, it kind of sticks to your neck. It drives me a little nutty, but <laughs> so I like this one. All right, so that's two. I'm not gonna have enough room over here, but we're gonna, we're gonna figure it out. These bags, I'm telling you, we're holding on to those. Those are very nice. All right, oh, this one looks like yarn. Let's take a look here. Okay, another bag. Stack those up neat, they won't overflow. Okay, so this was just, um, there's no description. I don't have a, oh, this is soft though. So I ordered, it came in, came in threes. Uh, Ceramel, maybe, I don't know. 1.76 ounces, 50 gram ball, 142 yards. I, this feels like it's acrylic, yeah. It's 100% acrylic. And you know, I can always use white to go with just about anything that you're making, right? So it's soft for acrylic. I'm not disappointed in how it feels. Uh, this would probably be a number three weight. Um, it looks pretty thin. I don't know if it says here. This is probably categorized as a four, but it doesn't say. Hook size 4.5 to 5.5. It could be a four, just not, a, well, see, because it looks a little bit bigger there, so probably a four weight. So, hmm. All right, so the yarny, the yarny aspects of it is not bad. Let me, I'm just really trying to, so far that's, that's not bad yarn. It can be used. And again, I'm just randomly grabbing. I'm not gonna go through the bag. Um, I'm just gonna grab a bag and see what's here. All right. Oh, okay, so this is an accordion file. Something else we use at work. Again, when I picked these items, I wanted to make sure that it was something that I was gonna use. So if you are a social worker, which I am full time, I have my small business on the side, you will know that we have lots of paperwork. There's just so much paperwork, guys. And um, this is like, like a little accordion to kind of keep things organized. This is something that I wanted to carry in my car. Sometimes we have to take extra forms, things like that. And this is plastic. So if you spill anything on it, it just wipes right off. That was just, that was such a great, thing when I saw that and yeah so I mean I wouldn't overfill it because it is just plastic um, but you know what it can hold it can hold several pieces of paper in each one so you've got you know you've got all that space in there that's and and again the price will be listed below so I do like this one I'm gonna sit this over here out of the, you know what I'm, guys I'm already running on spot we'll sit it right here <laughs> We'll just sit it right here. Okay, whoops. Man, these, these are really big bags for such a small, this is the only thing that was in there. But I'm really happy to get these bags because wow. If you guys have had these bags before if you ordered from Timu, they're very good bags. So this is a wall, um, it's a wall decal for my granddaughter. And that is just adorable, I love it. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Okay, next, 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 next. Um, and I love that they put these, I, I that they put them all in individual bags, but that's just one bag. And these were a pair of scissors. And these fold. So they fold in, these fold in. I think you get them and you, you grab each end and fold them up. 
So dragon alloy. Nice. Okay. Okay, there's another decal here. I've got one. I also ordered another yet for my granddaughter. She has these little stickers all throughout her bedroom wall on her walls. Um especially over her bed. So this says Black Princess. And I love that. I love it. Um, there are two. I don't think I had picked two of them, but I'm <laughs> sorry, I've got to open. Sometimes the bags are, uh, yeah, there's two. So this one could go to my other granddaughter. Yeah, I didn't know I had two of them in there, but I'm glad I did. All right, another thing of yarn. Each bag is, each bag is, um, it's just a little, oops, it's just a little slider. So there's going to be lots of rustling, guys. Sorry about that. Okay, this is, oh, this is the glow-in-the-dark yarn. Hmm, it's a little bit smaller than I had hoped for. Let's get it opened up. So I've got, it almost feels shiny, like it's mer mercerized. I don't know, whatever that word is. Let's see. Let me see what it says here. First class, warm water washing, neutral. Hmm. Okay, so there's not much information. Um, but it's supposed to glow in the dark. And it's too light outside for me to check that. So um, I'll let you guys know in the third video whether, you know, I really like it. Um, if I can, later on tonight, I'll probably take a video and, and show you guys. But... I liked that color, so right, let's grab one. All right, more yarn. Let's see what's in this. One. What colors are in here? I know what's in it. All right, let's see. Let's pack. Oh, okay. So these are smaller. They they don't feel like full skeins like the black one. Nope, that's not one. So it almost feels like half a skein. I don't know. I mean, I get it's 50% acrylic, 50% polyester. And I'm looking to see if it tells me how many yards. It does not. But this one is actually um, going to be for my daughter. She likes to knit. She has a little knitting machine, a Centro 48 needle. So she'll, she likes to make headbands. Nope. Yeah. Head, headbands slash ear warmers. And, um, She'll also be making hair twists, these hair ties with these. So hopefully these will work well. There's certain yarns that she doesn't really like that goes into her machine, but we've never tried these before. So we're gonna give them a try and, and see what she thinks about that. All right. So for that one, I would I hope I would have liked for them to be full. This is kind of what I was expecting, but the other ones are kind of flat. But, you know, try it out and see. All right, this, I don't know. I don't remember what this is. Let's take a look. Oh, it's a small yarn bag. Okay. Okay. It's a small yarn bag. So, <laughs> it's super cute, though. So, it is smaller than I thought. <clears throat> Here's the bag. And it came folded down. So, it's, you know, it's folded down. Got it up here. So you put your yarn in here. Um, this would be ideal if you knit or crochet socks or just a, if you just have like maybe one or two skeins of maybe cotton yarn, you can fit that in there. And then that's what this hole is for. The yarn goes through that hole and then you just zip it up. I mean, it's got a handle and everything. <clears throat> so it's made really nice. So it's not, yeah, it doesn't feel cheap or anything. So this might go on vacation with me. That's super cute because you could always, you know, you've got your hook, you could always put it on your arm and crochet and just have that string hanging there. So that's not bad. Not bad at all. All right, next. Oh my goodness, I don't, I almost didn't feel anything in here. It's so light. Let's see what this is. You know what? I'm going to turn these bags. The, I keep flipping them around. It's driving me crazy. Let me turn these bags the opposite way. And stack them all up the same. Okay. Um, I have, 
a bracelet. Let's open this up and see what it is. Because I do not remember. Um, I believe, I don't know. It's either a bracelet or a charm. My daughter has um, Crocs. Nope, because it doesn't have a place to like poke them through. I don't know guys, I think they're, they're definitely charms though. Mickey Mouse and a cute little bling ring type of thing. So this could be for my granddaughter. I really should have written this down, but it's kind of fun because it's kind of like Christmas, but it's like, I don't remember what I ordered. Let's just see what's in here. So it looks really cute. We love Mickey Mouse in this house. So someone will benefit. Okay, so remember I was telling you I do have a small business. So I'm gonna take these out of the package. When I have a sale, I put these um, on the outside of the envelope when I, when I ship it out. And I also put it on the bag when I have a customer come to my booth when I'm doing a craft show. So it says, thank you for supporting my small business. And this, there's a hundred of them in here. And if, if I remember correctly, um, when we were looking on, when I was looking on the website, these may have been like three bucks, not much at all. So, and I use these every time I have a sale, put them on all my bags. So that was a good deal for me. Um, oh, okay. Let's get in here. All right, so right now I'm making towel holders for an upcoming craft show and they had the wooden rings that I was looking for. I have some, but I've made um, the towel rings or the towel holders and these rings have, I'm getting less and less. I just want to open one. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, these are great. These will work just fine. So you just crochet on them. You can crochet a, a strip and put them around here with a button. And then you put one side on one end of the bar or the arm and then the other one. And then you put your towel through there. And that's how it holds on to the arm of your oven. So, and let me see how many are in here. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. There's 30 of them. So that's 15 sets that I can, or 15 towel holders that I can make. And that was a good deal. I, I wish I could remember how much they are. But again, before I before you see this, the price will be at the bottom. And those are made very well. They're every bit as good as the ones I purchased at Hobby Lobby, so. Okay, this is, what is this? Oh, it's a diamond painting. Oh, let's open this up. That's right. Okay, my daughter has been wanting to get into these diamond paintings. And I want to see. I hope I don't knock anything over. Okay, so here's the painting. Okay, isn't that beautiful? Like a mandala. And then here is all the... the stuff that you need. I've never done a diamond painting, but everything that you need is here. And that's, that is a really good deal. This was not very much either. I remember that it wasn't very much, which is why I added it to the list because I wanted to show in case someone, I can't put it back in the bag, but in case someone else was interested, that's nice. All right, let's see here. This looks like a journal. Um, I write in a journal a lot. And I have so many of these around my house, it's ridiculous. So yes, that's what this is. Let's open this up, take a look. Okay, so obviously it's not real leather, but this feels really nice. I mean, it doesn't feel cheap. Um, oh, it's got, <laughs> it was like, what's falling here? All right, so let me show you. It's like a, like nautical. And there's the binding, it's got the, page holder, pay, uh, bookmark, someone, I mean, I just, um, let's see, 
yeah, we can just set it like that. I don't know what this other one is for, but um, maybe just as a decoration. My daughter, my middle daughter is the one. She hold a page, she page holder. <laughs> you don't say bookmark when you're like four. She's 30 now, but you know. So the paper's not bad. I don't know, I'm not, I don't even mind that it's like a tan color. Um, I don't mind that it's not lined. I think it says that it's unlined paper. Uh, if you don't like unlined paper, I mean, it's a binder. You could always put your own in there. Um, so it's not, not bad at all. Uh, maybe this is to use it to seal it up because I'm wondering how you close that up. Hmm. In any case, and anyway, it's really cute. So it's worth it. I'll stick that over there so it's out of the way. All right. Oh my goodness. One little thing in this bag. That's so neat. Because these bags are great. This is um hmm. Looks like a clip of some kind. Hmm. So it is a clip. It looks like it goes through something. Darn it, I wish the description was on here. Anyway, whatever it is, it's made really well. It's got two, two bolt thingy divots, whatever, uh, pivots, oh, whatever. It's Friday, oh, my brain's not functioning. <laughs> but there you go. All right, does anybody feel like that? When the weekend starts to roll around, you're like, oh, I don't wanna do anything, I don't wanna go anywhere. Okay. This was yarn that I picked for something I'm doing for Christmas. It's Christmas, you can see it's Christmas colors. I'm gonna keep that wrapped though. Um, but this is something that I can use to crochet. Probably um, coasters maybe. I wish I knew how much yardage was in here. But it's called Brick Red. And yeah, cause it's like, yeah. You can see, I don't know if you can see the string, but so it's more yarn and that definitely, oh, I thought that was gonna hit me in the face. <laughs> oh. All right, we've got, oh, let's take it out of the box. Oh, now we've got another one, just a smaller version. So where was the one that I had? So this one, this is a larger journal and this is a smaller one. So, this would be great for putting, um, you know, if you just have notes for writing, writing down patterns, which I do, or if you just want to write in a journal, write your thoughts down. My foster kids used to always have their own journal so they can write down anything that they were going through in case they didn't want to have to talk to an actual person. And I think it's a great idea. Okay, so we've got a necklace here. Oh man, guys, there's so much stuff in this box. This is gonna be a long one. Be prepared, get a drink. All right, so this is a heart necklace with red, white, and blue. That is super cute. And this is something that my granddaughter will absolutely love. She's got this cute little um, 4th of July outfit and this is gonna go so great with that. That is just adorable. Yeah, I really like that. And the chain, I mean, sometimes you, I mean, this chain is, it's like a rope chain, very thin, but it's, its I mean, look at that. That's good and sturdy. Hmm, I like it. All right, next. Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna have so many of these great bags. All right, so another thing that they have, um, my daughter ordered the, I think they were anime stickers. So I also put stickers in when I make a sale. And depending on what time of year it is, that's kind of, a lot of times they're inspirational stickers, but if I have fall stickers, winter stickers, whatever. So these were 50 and I think it was like, I don't know. I don't wanna, don't quote me, but I bet it wasn't more than $3. And I absolutely love Jack Skellington. So these stickers are from The Nightmare Before Christmas. And you get a whole stack. 
in this little package. And there's just 50 of them in the, for like less than three bucks. You can stick them on, I believe they're, oh, I love this one. This one, that one's my favorite. I can't show them all to you. We'll be here like forever, you guys. But um, yeah, I ordered a bunch of these. Um, and I've got Halloween, I've got Christmas, um, thank you stickers. I have so many. I'm not even gonna be able to put those back in the bag, I know. So that was definitely worth the price, I'm telling you now. I'm trying to just grab something. All right, so I've got a, an envelope inside of a bag. Let's see what's in here. Oh, it really doesn't say. All right, let's see. Oh, <laughs> they're scissors. <laughs> they're just like poking me right in my face. Okay. Oh, the handles are really cute. Wow, these suckers look sharp. <laughs> I'm just saying, they look really sharp. Look at that handle though, isn't that beautiful? Hmm. Yeah, they're pretty sharp. So yeah, a crafter can always use extra scissors. I'm never without scissors. So these will replace the ones that are going bad. And those feel like they are made very well. So I'm excited about that. All right, next. All right, I'm gonna take this out. I got another lanyard. This one is definitely for my daughter. She's in high school and she has her her ID, um, her school ID with her picture on it. So I just got two of the same. If I can get it out of the bag, oh my goodness. All right, so yep, same thing. And I attached mine. So it comes like this. All you do is stick it in there after you put your, and it snaps right in place. Ta-da. All right. It looks like I've got some more stickers, you guys. These stickers are great, I'm telling you. If you have kids that like stickers on water bottles, or even if you like them, I would get them on here. I don't know what kind these are. Let me see. The sticker's like right in the front, the, the other sticker. Oh, these are inspirational. Be still and know that I am God. Psalms 4610. Okay, so there's a bunch of them. I send these and I put these in there as well. Some of them just have cute little butterflies. Um, faith make all things faith makes all things possible. And I know that a lot of them, um, a lot of the description might say um, water bottle stickers. So, and I, I'm not using mine for that purpose, but the, I mean, for, you get like 20, anywhere from 25 to 50. This one was 50. I remember, I think all the stickers that I purchased had at least 50 in there. Definitely worth the, the, you know, pennies on the dollar that you gotta spend for it. All right, and oh my goodness, this is so cute. This is so cute. Look at this. It's a hair claw, right? And it's got these cute little, little crocheted flowers on them. Look at that. My daughter uses these claws all the time. I might have to keep this one. <laughs> that is good and sturdy. The grip is nice and the grip is nice and um, tight. It's not real loose, so you know it's gonna hold your hair. I have really thick hair, so I might have to, if she sees this, I know she's gonna take it, but I'm gonna use it first. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah, there's something in here. More stickers, it looks like. Oh my gosh, I, I mean, in this bag, you guys. These bags are awesome. Oh, okay, so these are for the little watches. They're just extra. If I can get them, oh, you know what? Let's use my handy dandy new scissors. Ta-da. All right. Okay, so um, wait a minute, because I've got one of them. I've got two of the exact same ones. That's not gonna work. Are they all the same? Hold on, let's see. I don't know how they can all be the same and, and be classified as a, <clears throat> excuse me, replacement for your band. So see, there's no, I'm, there's no place to attach it. So these look like they're all the same. You're supposed to have a short one and a long one. Maybe we have one in there, I don't know, but it's, there's just rubber, so, and we, we needed something that was gonna be good and waterproof. 
So hopefully the other ends are on here because these look like just the one section. So I'm gonna sit those right there and hopefully we can find the rest. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I don't know what that is. I hope I didn't bang it up too much. <clears throat> All right, this is, I don't know, we're gonna open it up. Okay, this is an under the counter drawer. So the noise you hear is probably the instructions and the screws. So I was thinking about putting this, well, I'm not thinking I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put it under the cabinet in my kitchen. Um, and once it's secured underneath, it's like a little slide and drawer just to put things in. I don't know what I'm gonna put in there, but I just thought it was really cool. So that's where, it go, that's where it's gonna go. So that's pretty cool. All right, more stickers, more stickers. You can always use more stickers. And I got this really nice little um, plastic plastic organizer in part one of this of my Timu unboxing video. And these can go in there with my cards. So these are the same ones that says thank you for shopping my small or supporting my small business. Oh, I don't know what's in here, but it's heavy. Oh, hold on. All right, wow, this is really heavy. Okay, I believe this is one of the crochet slash knitting kits that I ordered. Let's see. It's a travel size. Let's see, make it, make it with us always behind. I don't know. So I'm not gonna open it just yet. I just wanted to show you guys on the outside. It looks like it's made out of, it feels like, um, like a nylon, so it's easily, um, wait, it's easy to clean. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that, but let's open it up and see what's in here. I thought for sure this was a, oh yeah. Okay, so you open it up. There is a bunch of stuff in here and it's for knitting and crocheting because there's hooks in here. So there are hooks, um, looks like stitch markers, um, Wow, there's I don't I don't knit, so I know there's there's no needles, but I know oh there's little ones there. those are crochet hooks. There's a pair of scissors in here, measuring tape, ruler. Wow, that's what's so heavy. And guess what? You get yarn to go with it. So that's really cool. And there is a pouch. I'm gonna take this out. So this is probably for the hooks once you take them um, out of the package. This one as well. Something to go, just, nope, not there, hold on. So yeah, I bet this is probably where you put it and then you just sit your yarn in here, put it in there and zip it right up. So it says travel on the front. So this would be a great little pouch to keep your needles or your hooks in. Um, I don't think the straight needles would go in here, but circular needles would definitely be able to fit inside this pouch. So that is really nice. Hmm, I like it. Okay, more stickers. I feel like I ordered a bunch of stickers. Let me just get a bunch of stuff out of here so I can, cause it's, otherwise we're gonna be here forever, you guys. Two bags, stickers. Okay, um, more inspirational stickers. We just take a couple out. Oops. I like just taking a few out just to see. Oh, <laughs> Dr. Seuss. They're Dr. Seuss stickers. I just made some thing one and thing two hats. How cute is that? So that's what that is. Um, <laughs> very cute. All right, so I've got those. And then this one, I don't know what kind of stickers they are, but let's look. They kind of look like cards. Oh, they're like little mini, little mini um, movie posters. My, my granddaughter has mini brands and I thought these would be really cute. I'll have to look at them though, because I don't want her to have like Fight Club. So, but, <clears throat> excuse me. But there are some really cute ones in here. All right, as long as they're, um, appropriate. If not, I'll just give them to my 16 year old. But isn't, I just thought that was the cutest little thing. I love movies. So 
yeah. Like this one, they're spirited away. Wonder. So if you're looking for like, you know, if you've got some, what is that? Oh, Beetlejuice, there you go. That's interesting. Okay. So now I know what those are. And they said that they were miniature, so I'm not at all surprised about the size in that. I'm gonna open up a few more just really quick. So we have them. All right. Should have done two at a time to begin with. Um, more stickers. Can't have enough. Um, this is a cute little case, so I don't know if there's anything inside there. Let's take a look. Oh, where is it? Scissors. Well, I'm so glad I kept these out. These things are awesome. All right, let's see. Oh, it's for cards. Look at that. So it's got little areas for you to stick your cards in. I don't know if my cards would fit in there. Mine might be a little too long. But um, if it didn't have, I think if it didn't have the accordion, I feel like I could probably put like maybe 10 or 15 cards in there. So we'll see. Maybe you could stick like a couple of dollars in there and put it in your kids. I mean, it could be a little wallet. It's really cute. Nice little plastic case. And I love purple. So, all right, let's see what else we have here. Oh, there's some more little stickers for my granddaughter's wall. These are super cute, you guys. Oh, I cannot wait for her to put those on. Those are just adorable. All right, it looks like I've got some crochet hooks here. Um, let's see. yes. Oh my gosh, these are every bit as nice as I knew they'd be. Sometimes you see the picture, you're just not, you're not 100%, but I was like, those look really nice. Look. Yeah, they're coming out of the bag right now. So these are good. These are good. Look at those handles. Hold on, let me hold it this way. Hold them upside down. So these are the handles. And they're they're soft. I was expecting them to be like a really hard plastic or something, but um, they're not. They feel like rubber, but um, the grip is really good. So I'll have to try these out. Nice, nice, nice. All right, I'm very happy with that. If you're a crocheter, you totally understand <laughs> where I'm coming from because these are nice. I love them. All right, let's see what else we got here. Let's grab two things out. Just like more stickers. I'm just trying to grab a bag. They're getting folded up inside of each other. All right. This is sticky notes. I don't know what, oh, okay, I see. Rectangular sticky notes. Oh, okay. They're rectangular, stick, rectangular sticky notes in pastel colors. So the regular size, I thought I had one here. Hmm. Well, the, you know, the regular ones are probably about that size. So they're just a little bit longer than your normal sticky notes. You can always use sticky notes at work, just letting you know. So, and again, all the prices will be listed. I'll also have them in the description box below. So all you have to do is click on it and you are good to go. So this is some weird stickers. I think I got these for my daughter, but um, yeah, I don't know. They're just kind of, but they're, they're all stickers. Sushi cues. So they're just kind of like a play on words. Cream egg. Elders, old school glue, and then you see that there's an older old gentleman on there. Um, clucky charms. <laughs> Those are cute. Wobblers. And I'll show you one more before we get going. Lucky stride. Danger. <laughs> yeah, this is just a play on words with the stickers. Super, super cute. Okay. Uh, let's see here. All right. All right, 
guys. Another wall decal. Ooh. Little melon. melon. I don't know, guys. I can't read that, but that's super cute. I love it. My granddaughter will love it, and that's all that matters. She is going to love this. More stickers. I'm not going to take them out, but they are Mario Brothers. You see those Nintendo? You see Mario and Luigi and Yugi? No, Yogi? I don't know. Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> I don't know. I'm just, I'm just being funny. Okay, so here we have um, just a picture. Just a picture book or picture wallet. Ugh. My goodness. Okay. So this one is also for my granddaughter. It's just a cute little booklet with a little heart on the front. Um, she loves to get pictures from her friends. And I thought this would be cute to put her their school pictures in. And she can keep it in her little purse. Um, and that's, that's pretty cool. It's got little cats on it. But yeah, that's made really nice. I like the way that feels. Oh, another case. Let's see what this is. A nice shade of green. This looks like, um, this is a uh, card holder as well. There, now this one I like. So you just stick a few cards in there, close it up, fits right in your pocket. Although this one got a little dented, but it's, it is cute. So there you go, just open it up, put a couple of, now you can only fit maybe five cards in there. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, yay, more crochet hooks. Oh, I get excited when I see crochet hooks, guys. Oh, my goodness. This is another set that's really nice. So if you crochet, you will know this is a good metal or aluminum. It's a, they're aluminum. A alum, good aluminum set of crochet hooks. So... I'm very happy with this one as well, very happy. So far the crochet stuff has been just great um, for the for this crochet anyway. Sometimes you, you want, you know, you get crocheting items and they're just not what you expected. So those hooks are really nice. I mean, everything so far has just been great. There's been a few things that I questioned, but nothing real major. So this stainless steel scissors, let's take a look. Oh, these are gorgeous. Look at that. Do you see the iridescent on the, the steel part? And then the purple handle. Man, I'm gonna have to hide these from my daughter. These are very good quality scissors. Oh my goodness, that's great. These will be for sewing. I don't sew very often, but these are gonna be held just for that. And I'm gonna keep them right inside the box they come in this great box. Look at that. Those are great. Not cheaply made, I guarantee you that. Absolutely wonderful. Ooh. Man, I went crazy with the hooks, guys. Crazy with the hooks. That's all right. You can never have enough. I keep crocheting in my vehicle. So these I ordered because they come with the bigger size ones. This is a 10 millimeter hook. So that's probably the biggest, 10, then nine, and then eight on down to the tiniest. Oh, I won't use that. But people who do amigurumi use the smaller ones. But oh, I love it. Good aluminum set of hooks. Man. I feel a giveaway coming on saying it's coming all right i'm gonna take two more out because i know this video is getting we're at 44 minutes already guys i told you it was gonna be a long one they packed this bag of stuff i'm telling you it's absolutely packed i'm trying to get as much stuff out as i can um this is wonderful all right this is just a plastic bag it feels like it's probably more post-it notes 
but I'm not 100%. Oh, this is the money. This is the money. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. So my, my grandson saw someone at school brought them. Now it's, it clearly says copy money, right? On the back as well. But I thought this would be fun for him. That's neat. That is really cool. Hmm. All right. Let's see what we got here. This is, oh, these are wonderful, you guys. There are two in a package and it's um, a razor. So you see how that, there's a little button right here. When I push that up, the razor comes out. So when you have to cut something, oh yeah, works really great. And it stays, it'll stay up. I just, and then it goes right back down. And it comes two to a package. That is really neat. And you never, I mean, I don't know about you, but I never have these um, when I really need to cut something. So I ordered them because look at how small that is. Fits right in the palm of your hand, which means it could fit in my pocket or it can fit like in my car in a little compartment. So I know that I have something there in case I need to cut something. And scissors sometimes will poke through things. These will not because you have to actually push it up to get to the blade. So that's a good one. All right, so we've got, oh, thank you cards. All right. Look at that. Thank you for supporting my small business. These go in my packaging when I have a sale online that I mail to ship or when I ship them out. So great. I believe you get 50. Okay. That's awesome. That was well worth it because the last, and I know these were probably maybe three or $4. I spent $9 on the last set I got that had 50 of them like that. So I will definitely be ordering more of those once I run out. Another lanyard, I won't be taking it out because you guys have already seen it. I'm trying my best guys to get this, to get this under a certain amount. I know it's, I know it's running, but there's so much wonderful goodness in here. Okay, so this is a shelf for the wall. So it comes with the little stickies. It comes with the hooks that go in here. You put it on the wall and then you can just use it to hang. Now in the picture, I believe they showed this, um, uh, the, the girl had her necklaces hanging on it. I mean, but you can, you can pretty much do just not, you just can't obviously put anything really heavy on here, but um, it's got little shelves and everything. Maybe if you take off your rings or your watch or something, you can sit them on there on the wall. Great thing to have. And it feels like it's in, um, that it's, you know, not really cheaply made. So I really don't remember ordering another one of the, maybe I was thinking about both of my granddaughters. I think that's what it was. Oh goodness. All right, oh, this one's a big one. Let's see what's in here. Another shelf, I believe. You know, I, I mean, I honestly, they just have anything that you might want. So I ordered this. Um, this is definitely for my daughter. Uh, if you're a dog lover, look at the little paw prints in there. Our dog just passed away. Um, it's going on two months now and she was 14. But my daughter has two Frenchies um, and they are just adorable. So I thought she might like this shelf. And it just, you know, it feels like it's made really well. It's um, it's not like that hard plastic that would break or crack really easily because I it's got some give to it. So um, I don't know. I think that's really cute. And she will definitely find something to do with it for her little puppies, my grand dogs. All right. So I got a um, tablet protector. That's what that is right there. Um, wait a minute, I think we can write on this. I thought it was just for, let's take a look. I'm gonna take it out of this box. Okay, so.
so oh well look at that oh, how do you get the pin out oh you push it out through the back okay so you see there the pin goes the pin goes in the front and then you just push it out to get it it's kind of like so then they can write how would they get it off hmm I don't know, that's interesting. Unlock. Oh, isn't that clever? So watch this, okay? I just wrote my name. I don't know if you guys can see that. Oh, the lighting. There, I wrote my name. There's a button right here. So on the back, you have to slide it on. There's a button, okay, for delete. Watch, watch what happens. That's cool. Now my grandkids are gonna love this. You can like, I mean, I made a little smiley face and then, this is so cute. I'm gonna turn that back off, it's on lock. So it has a button for lock or unlock. Okay, I'm impressed, that's adorable. <laughs> painting, it says painting graffiti practice calculus. Hmm. So it's got a battery, it's battery operated, LCD writing tablet. That's cool. Hmm, all right. I think this is definitely gonna get some use out of it today. All right, guys, we are at the bottom, that's it. That is the last item. Well, this is the last, not that one. This is the last item in this bag. Man, was there a lot of stuff, guys. Okay, this was another journal. We write a lot in this house if you haven't figured that out yet. But like I stated earlier, um, whenever I have, whenever I have um, any kids here, you know, foster kids, grandkids, they wanna write things down or draw. These, this is just adorable. It is so cute. It's just like the red one and the brown one. The brown one's a little bit smaller. But yeah, I am, um, I am very impressed with everything that's here. Um, I definitely wanna thank Timu for reaching out to me for um, doing an unboxing and a review. Uh, you know, I get it. There's gonna be lots of links in the description box below. Click on everything that I've shown here will be in the description box. So all you have to do is click on that. And then there'll be the prices. I'll have the prices popping up as I show them to you guys. And hopefully you will click on there and take advantage of that 30% off. It's a great deal. And they already have low prices. And so far, everything, I mean, I know a lot of people are skeptical about Timu, but from what I've seen, it's really, really not that bad. And it's very affordable. I love those bags. Um, I'm very happy. This, this is like one of the, these rings. Woo, if you're a crafter. These things are awesome. I love them. The crochet, from the crochet hooks to the scissors. Look at those things. They're amazing. So I didn't have an end to this. I have no idea why um, they were here. I don't know what they're supposed to be used for. Um, I'll look them up. I'll look them up and find out. So this was the only thing that I had an issue with not knowing what to do with because they're all the same. And usually you have one short one to put around, I, I, I honestly don't know what these are. Could they, I mean, could they just be um, like for attaching? Um, let me look. Cause you know, they look like a Ziploc. Look at that, I bet that's what that is. I bet that's what that is to hold something in place. Now, wouldn't that be cool? I bet you anything that's what that is. See, it just takes your brain a little time to, to you know, it's. That I don't like that it doesn't come with a list of everything to give you a little description. So you kind of got to play detective. But we have figured it out. Ta-da. All right. So there you go, guys. Um, I hope you liked this video. Put your comments in the description box below. And remember, if you are a new user to Timu, download that app and get that 30% off. And take your time because they have... Uh, so much stuff. 
There's just so much to look at. So if you're thinking about something in your head, put it in the description box. It's probably going to pop up. I'm just saying. So <laughs> um, yeah, we're at 55 minutes. I'm going to, I'm going to get off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. I hope this was informative, especially for the crafters in you. So have a good day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.